2018 FIM International Six Days of Enduro produces a special anniversary for the Women's World Trophy. Founded on the event's first visit to Chile back in 2007, the women's competition has gone from strength to strength in its 10 subsequent stagings. No team has better exemplified that than the dominant Australians, who target a record-breaking sixth title this season. There's all, you know, when we were setting up, there's a lot of young girls from Chile coming around looking for autographs. It's really good. It's, it's encouraging them and, and other women to, to maybe get involved in this sport or another sport that they want to try to show there's no limits. Winning has brought a lot, of, a lot of attention to us and I've seen a lot of young females look up to us. Um, I just try to be as positive as I can with them and show that anything is possible. Like, I was just a young kid once riding a peewee and now I'm here, five-time world champion, so anything is possible and I hope there's a lot more young girls coming into the sport. The secret to success for the women from Down Under has been their work to create a genuine team atmosphere, facilitated not just by their geographical proximity, but by dedication to work together towards what is a unique nation's competition in the sport. Even the team's newcomer, Mackenzie Tricker, already has a strong relationship with her teammates. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, I grew up with both of these girls. Um, we all have had a motocross background and we all were from the same state back in Australia. Um, so obviously I followed them and I've seen their results and they've always been good riders. So, I mean, I really expect nothing less. Me and Mackenzie were seeing each other every weekend at the track and even Jess, she was around most of the time as well. So. We were kids playing together, now we're adults racing together on the other side of the world and it's awesome and we're like very strong together so it'll be good. Part of Australia's success has been the continuity of an unchanged lineup through five years of victories. But even with a new look for 2018, they hope to recreate their famous team spirit and continue their winning run in an ever stronger women's trophy. It was quite special because it was always the three same chicks, but you know, at the end of the day, we're still Aussie chicks. Um, we'd like to carry that through for not only our country, everyone back home is cheering for us. Um, it, it's kind of like a new era, but it's also, we're going to keep carrying that through and get that uh, trophy back on our shores, hopefully. It's cool to see uh, we're all pushing the limit. Uh, more girls are getting faster, there's a lot more competition. So it's going to be really interesting this year to see how it goes, but uh, Team Australia is feeling good and I know, we're happy to be here again.